Okay, I just wanted to do another video um, as a, something of an expansion on the uh, problem that certain people on Mac are having with, um, let's say, the colour management side of Lightroom Classic CC and uh, when moving from the library to the develop module and these uh, crushed shadows and uh, crushed darker tones in an image. Um, here we are in the last iteration of the Lightroom CC 2015 um, in other words the version of Lightroom that we were on before Lightroom Classic got dropped on us like a bomb the other day and uh, as you can see I've got this raw file note the name of the raw file and note there are no developed settings applied to it whatsoever so this is a direct import out of the camera with no adjustment we're in the library module we go over to the develop module and there is absolutely zero change in the image and if I scoot over to Lightroom preferences you can see that I have graphics um, GPU acceleration enabled and it's picking up the OpenGL this is a GTX 970 so it's um, OpenGL V4.3 or 4.4 and uh, well we'll soon find out because we go to the system info and uh, there we go GTX 970 open GL support passed bloody bloody blah, blah, blah everything in the gardens rosy however if we go and switch over to the same image in Lightroom Classic yes now did you notice a change as we switched from Lightroom as it used to be in the develop module over to the library module for the same image view of the same image and um, in Lightroom classic mm, no looks exactly the same doesn't it and yet if I go and hit the develop tab you'll notice we're now getting block tones down here and that sky has really gone a lot deeper darker got more dark tones in it we'll do it again switch back to the library view watch this area here this area here and down here switch back to the develop module yes okay and if we go over to the preferences we don't want catalog settings Andy go over to the preferences and you can see that we've got GPU um, acceleration turned on and we've got this strange metal um, I'm not a GPU expert so I don't know what it is and we go up the system in, system info and uh, yeah it's showing up metal again um, and I just think this is the problem that we're having um, why don't we just use OpenGL and if it is looking for OpenGL I don't know but if it is looking for OpenGL it can't find it um, but there's obviously by doing this side by side comparison you can tell there is actually nothing wrong with the computer system that I'm using because it worked perfectly fine before Adobe perfectly fine so you know have you never heard of that phrase we have in England if it ain't broke don't fix it anyway if we go close and uh, I go back to my preferences again and I actually scoop that across there and I just turn off GPU acceleration and there we go we're back to our normal looking image inside the develop module of Lightroom CC Classic or Lightroom Classic CC and uh, that's just it um, I found so far that running without GPU acceleration doesn't really affect the speed um, Lightroom Classic is definitely faster but I can't help thinking it would be an awful lot faster if I could use this but obviously because I can't use it because of these dark tones um, inside the develop module I don't want them that dark so if I go on into the basics panel sort of and I go and lift the uh, shadow detail up yeah until I get the sky looking as I want it then obviously I'm making an adjustment and um, it isn't really needed and that is my problem um, because when we do the actual output file for this the sky will actually be too light so 
for the moment until Adobe addressed the problem I'm going to be running with GPU acceleration turned off inside Lightroom Classic and uh, just open Prey and they give me the uh, support that's needed for this uh, slight system problem so uh, there we go end of uh, video see you soon